they were subject to entrapment. So not necessarily because you've got a clearance does it mean that you won't, if someone says, oh mate, I saw you down at the whatever the other day, I hope you had a good time. By the way, would you mind taking this into parliament for me? Now, I would have thought, Mr Commissioner, that the New South Wales Parliament is the most symbolic terrorist target building in Australia. I mean, that would be subject, I mean, there are lots of targets, Harbour Bridge, the Opera House, mm -hmm. but this building, and up until this point, most people working in this building know that it's safe. I don't think it any longer is. And to demonstrate that, this morning I brought in what could be, I brought this through security, a pipe bomb. Um, I also brought in, when I was a kid, we used to blow stumps out on the farm 50 years ago. Um, we'd, get, we'd get some nitropril, a, a quart of distillate, a plug of jelly and a detonator, light the bloody thing and go to buggy. We could blow a tree the size of this building out of the ground. At the present time, there's nothing to stop anyone from bringing those ingredients in here over a period of time through security. Would you agree? Well, Senator, under the current arrangements, that is a, a risk, yes. So I'm appealing to people to find a way to convince no, the Department of Finance Sorry. that to drop security, and I've actually taken the trouble, Sorry. as you know, to talk to the various authorities, including the security organisations. The department says they've cleared it from you fellows, they've cleared it from security, they haven't. This building is no longer secure.